Hello, I'm George Nero, Chair of Pathology at UAB. Welcome to our virtual tour. We would like to highlight some of the great facility that we have and more importantly introduce members of our great team of almost 100 faculty and over 50 trainees. At UAB, we strongly believe in the value of our training program in shaping the next generation of pathologists in the U.S. An integral part of our training program is an emphasis on wellness, diversity, inclusion, and leadership development. We do this with a focus on all three areas of UAB's mission, teaching, service, and research. We offer abundant teaching opportunities for our residents in the medical school, dental school, school of public health, and school of health professions. This highlights not only our residents' commitment to teaching students, but also recruiting new pathologists for the field. We hope that you enjoy this virtual tour of our great department. Welcome to the UAB Gross Pathology Lab, where you will do a wide range of specimens from biopsies up to complex resections. You will find plenty of space to begin your education as a pathologist. Um, we have a very robust PA support system to aid in your education and training. We also have some of the best technology in the field right now, including Dragon voice recognition software, Vantage specimen tracking, and also a Faxatron. And if you don't know what a Faxatron is now, you'll know later and you'll thank us. We also have a time in which we get together every day at 2 o'clock at a consultant conference where different subspecialty experts may show cases to have the opinion of the rest of the group. This is a good opportunity you not know, also for the faculty to get together, but also for fellow, that be able, like instructor and resident, to learn from the pathologist with more experience. Hello and welcome to UAB's autopsy suite. We have amazing attendings and the best support staff. This is one of our rooms and we have a mirroring room just like this. We also have a room for infectious diseases such as COVID. On the UAB autopsy service we perform anywhere between 300 and 350 autopsy cases per year. So we have cases that are forensic cases, we have adult uh, cases, and we also have perinatal autopsy cases here at UAB. Annually the cytopathology service receives about 15,000 pap smears. Additionally, we receive close to 8,000 non-gynecological specimens to include pulmonary, urine, cerebrospinal fluid, bone, breast, and additionally GI specimens. As a resident on site of pathology at UAB, you get to experience a variety of patient material. You get to see so many different types of cases. We have GYN, we have non-GYN. Additionally, you get to go on rapid on-site evaluations in our endoscopy and bronchoscopy suites and those are always new and exciting and surprising. You will sign out twice a day. We sign out once in the morning and once in the afternoon, and the resident attends all the sign outs. We also have a thyroid FNA clinic at the Kirkland Clinic, and residents and fellows can participate in FNAs if that's something that they're interested in. Additionally, we have an amazing cytopathology fellowship program available at UAB. They take up to two fellows a year, and the fellows and the residents really work together as a team. Welcome to our frozen room. This is where you'll come with an attending and one of our histotech staff in order to provide intraoperative diagnosis and management guidance to our surgical colleagues. When our residents rotate in transfusion service or uh, more uh, informally called blood bank, they spend four months working with an amazing number of staff that are specialized. Here we also supply blood products for patients in various uh, uh, disciplines. So one of the advantages, one of the things the residents enjoy the most when they're rotating with us is the interaction with residents in other programs. So for example, surgery residents often need blood products, um, uh, ob obstetrics and gynecologists. Uh, many different specialties uh, uh, interact with our residents during this rotation. So UAB Hospital is the only level one trauma center in a very large area that uh, encompasses Alabama, but also some neighboring states. So our laboratory, our blood bank, supplies blood products for trauma patients that come from multiple locations. Part of our transfusion medicine rotation includes therapeutic apheresis, 
in which you will oversee inpatient and outpatient procedures such as therapeutic plasma exchange, red blood cell exchanges, photophoresis, stem, co stem cell collections for bone marrow transplants, and CAR T collections. In addition to our outstanding anatomic pathology program, UB also has a wonderful uh, clinical pathology program, especially in the areas of microbiology, molecular pathology, and hematopathology. Currently, we're sitting in our hematopathology sign-out room, where we sign out with our attendings uh, that would include residents and fellows, as well as possible medical students. Behind me, you'll see the multi-headed scope, as well as the screen for additional viewing purposes. We're in the core lab where samples are received, particularly through our tubing system. Uh, once a specimen is received, it is accessioned and placed on a conveyor system where it will be sent to its respective areas for processing. This is just one of our many AP resident rooms. While each person has their own computer and microscope, the open environment encourages discussion between our residents, visiting residents, and medical students. This is our CP resident room where our CP residents work on those rotations. We share this space with our heme path fellows. Transfusion medicine also is here with a transfusion fellow and we each have a workspace when we're on these rotations. This is a really great environment for working with our fellows. They're right here next to us as well as our senior residents to help give us education and guide us through cases. And there's always plenty of snacks for working late on a case. Thank you for joining us on the virtual tour that highlights key areas of the residency training program. The department is spread out across four buildings and there are four sites total in addition to the main hospital. All sites are within walking distance, so residents do not need to worry about parking. There are six total resident rooms, a separate room for those who are on call, and an individual office for the AP and the CP chief resident. For more information, such as benefits, specific rotation information, or contact information, visit our website. Thank you again, and go Blazers!